Well, let's switch gears now to the much talked about uh, Naira notes. There's been mixed reactions from Lagos residents since the Central Bank of Nigeria's directive to commercial banks across the country to disburse the old 200 Naira, 500 Naira and 1,000 Naira notes in compliance with the March 3rd ruling of the Supreme Court. A correspondent Funke at Soji went round some parts of the Lagos metropolis and now reports. Lagos residents have received with mixed feelings the directive from the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, to commercial banks across the country to disburse old 200 Naira, 500 Naira and 1,000 Naira notes and treat same legal tenders in compliance with the March 3rd ruling of the Supreme Court. This is coming 11 days after the ruling. Reacting to the CBN's directive, respondents expressed displeasure at the untold hardship Nigerians have experienced while hoping that banks would begin compliance. It came so late because it has really caused so many havoc in the country, you know. So many people have died in the sense of queuing on the queue, you know, and everything. But now that they said we should start spending the money, I have not seen any money yet though, but I just pray we start spending the money and everything, but boy, it really, it really came late. The government or the president, either president or the CBI governor, they should come out and clarify this issue. So we in Nigeria, we are good in making laws, but enforcing it, that's what matters. So they should enforce it and give order to all these banks that they should be dispatching it and be collecting it. For traders and artisans, this development was long overdue, considering the time of the ruling by the Supreme Court. According to them, the power play was detrimental to the masses. Now we have not been able to meet up our daily activities because of the issue of the money. Uh, the market is not going like before. Uh, well, now Sha, as they made the announcement overnight, I know everything will come to to Azizua. Everybody suffer. Some people die. Everybody's no food, no money. To go out is very uh, stressful before everybody could come out. So uh, the thing hard, you know, be small thing. You know. May God still continue to help us to bring the money out. Old notes, new notes should bring it out for us. As no money, new note, no day, no old notes again. But as you hear, see now the same day is old note. We never even see answer. People are suffer. People are died. It's very very hard to us. We market women. We don't see it easy at all. We don't even see the money. Even as they announce that we share, we can start spending it, we don't see the money. And when you even collect the old note inside market, they will not accept it. They don't collect it. Who are afraid that maybe? They will, they will still know that they should not collect it again. But well, that's what we said last time, that we should be collecting it. Later, they said, maybe they did not talk that we should not collect the money. People did not collect. But today, they said it. Maybe when everybody has heard that, it may they have talked. So anybody that brings it, they are going to collect it. Even the transfer, where people they do, some go enter, some no go enter. We don't tire for this country. As they don't talk, now they the collect it. May they no stop at my bed, may they collect at my may people no go die Sarao. Civil Bay News 24 also visited some banks across the metropolis where there were neither queues nor crowds at ATM sports as opposed to the norm since the introduction of the policy. Nigerians hope that banks would with immediate effect begin disbursement of the old Naira notes and accept same from the populace. Funke Adesoji, Civil Bay News 24, Lagos.